so uh, today I want to show you just an example of a new feature from a company called HeyGen. HeyGen is a platform that uses AI to help you create avatars and they are applicable for training, coaching, customer service, etc. You can see here uh, some of the different applications. I'm on the website now. So this is just the sort of public website and you can choose from hundreds if not more of avatars that you can then uh, you can pick, uh, activate and then uh, generate via text to video. So you can pick an avatar, you can then give it a script and or give it a, a knowledge base and say here are the different FAQs, etc. and then deploy it public to the public where people can ask questions about your product, service, etc. Now, it also has some added features. See here you can see some of the avatars. Uh, there's quite a few um, decent variety uh, of, of ethnicities, etc. cetera. Uh, you can see here backgrounds, but what's kind of really exciting and what I want to show you today is what you can do with some of the custom avatars. Now you can see here that I've been experimenting and I've made a few avatars uh, of myself and um, I, I affectionately call him Chris GPT. You get it? Chris G. PT. Um, so in any event, uh, the one I, I really want to show you today is the interactive avatar. So that's a relatively new feature. If you go down here to labs, right, and then over to interactive avatar, you can create an inter interactive avatar, basically the same way that you would create a custom avatar uh, on the rest of the platform, even outside of the labs. Um, and essentially how you do that is by turning on a camera or uploading video. I think for the interactive avatar, they want you to turn on a camera, you know, to yourself. Um, for a regular avatar, it has you just speak for about two minutes, two to five minutes or so. So it gets enough information about you, your tonal inflections, etc. cetera. Um, but for this one, it asks you to start out by just waiting for about 15 seconds because obviously we don't just talk the whole time that we're on calls and things like that. Uh, and then, to talk for about 90 seconds or so. And the reason for that is so that you can have that sort of interactive back and forth, uh, hence the interactive avatar. So this is the result of what I did, okay? So the cool thing about this is that I can then take this interactive avatar that I've created, and you can see I click on chat, and I have the option here to either start a new chat or to add this chat to my to a Zoom call, right? So. If I, start, if I click start a new chat, then it'll start chatting with me instantly. If I click on chat in a Zoom, then you can see here, it'll either give me the option to start a completely new Zoom, or if I'm on a call with someone and I wanna, I want, or if I'm gonna call by myself or whatever, and if an active call has already started and I want the, uh, the avatar to join that call, then I can just plug in the link right here and then have it come join the call. For now, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to have it start a new Zoom, the avatar, because I'm not on a Zoom. All right. Hi, I'm Chris G's AI assistant. If you're looking into AI training, workshops, or consulting for your PR and communications team, you're in the right spot. I can answer questions about Chris's services, pricing, and availability, and even help you book a call. Let's get started. So can you tell me, where, where is Chris G Consulting based? Chris G Consulting is based in Brooklyn, New York. If you have any more questions or need further information, feel free to ask. Can you give me an overview of Chris G Consulting's workshops? Certainly. Chris G. Consulting offers AI workshops specifically designed for PR and communications teams. Does Chris G. Consulting offer virtual workshops? Yes, Chris G. Consulting does offer virtual workshops. The virtual workshop is a 90-minute session designed for PR and communications teams. This format allows teams to engage with AI concepts and integration strategies from anywhere. If you're interested in booking a virtual workshop or have more questions, feel free to ask. 
This is weird. <laughs> this is so funny. All right. Thanks a lot, Chris G. Bye. I'm glad I could assist you. If you have more questions in the future, don't hesitate to reach out. Have a great day and goodbye. So that was pretty impressive. One last thing I want to show you is the, the way that you are able to program your avatar, your interactive avatar, and give it those responses that you just saw in, our, in my back and forth with my avatar is by creating a knowledge base. So you can see this is where you do it. Um, we were at this view when I initiated the chat and uh, just above it is uh, select knowledge base. So you can actually go in here. I've already obviously added a knowledge base. You can see here um, the kind of information that it asks you and what I put in here. And so this is all of the information that I gave it just for the purposes of this exercise. Um, you can imagine these responses or this knowledge base could could involve anything. It could involve FAQs. It could involve uh, other types of information. Uh, I think the sky's the limit with this type of technology. Uh, it's not perfect. It's far from perfect, but it's it's never going to be worse than it is today, and it's only going to be better. This time a year ago, this technology was far away from what it is today. So it's it's advancing rapidly, and it's getting a lot better. And I, I think a lot of possibilities for lots of different things that we can use for these applications. So let me know what you think. Um, send, me, send me a note. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know if you think uh, if there's anything else you'd like for me to, to test. Thanks a lot. Bye.